in that Chicago Marathon, it was one of the most inspiring races I've ever been in. There were 35,000 runners. They had estimated over a million spectators. As I was running during the race, they had these loudspeakers that tell where the leaders are and how they're doing. And uh, they came up every once in a while and they'd say, Khalid Kanuchi has just passed the 19 mile mark on world record pace. And then they would say, they came back later and said, Khalid Kanuchi just finished the marathon and missed the world record by 18 seconds. Well, that's pretty inspiring. Unfortunately, I was on about mile 18 at the time when he finished, but it was still inspiring to think that some body got that close to a world record in the race that I was running. Well, a few minutes later, they came on the loudspeaker again, and they said Paula Radcliffe had just broken the world record in that same race. And you know, as you're running, you start to think that you know, I, I actually participated in a world record. You know, my participation was very, very, very minimal. But, you know, I was still there. And that was, it really made you feel good. You know, inspiration is kind of like finding a good leader. Look for followers. If you find followers, you find a good leader. If you're looking for inspiration, look for people who are inspired. Okay, we're waiting for, we're watching Dean of Students, Neil Arter, come through right now. Here he comes. First 10K. Go, Neil! Go, Amanda! Yeah! 